Oh, right you tubers, welcome back to World of Warships with the Angry Nerd. And today we're getting our first look at the Russian battleships. This is the Tier 5, I'm not going to try it, but Google Translate says that means Peter the Great. So, this is the Russian Tier 5 Peter the Great. This ship is currently a work in progress. All stats and statistics may change before it hits the live server. So please keep that in mind. Let's take a quick look at the modules, the exterior, and the captain because all of those will affect the stats as it's set up right now. But just looking at the exterior of the ship, this is a really nice looking ship it does have super firing turrets front and back so that's very nice that means if you are bow tanking someone you can get both front turrets firing at them without having to angle too much so just straight on you can get both turrets firing and if you're running away running away you can fire two turrets in your retreat so yeah that's pretty nice um, modules. I do have the ship fully um, modified, so let's take a quick look at the upgrades since we're already on here. In slot number one, I took main armaments modification. Slot number two, damage control system modification. And slot number three, aiming system modification. These are all pretty standard. Um, ammunition and consumables you get damage control and repair so nothing exciting there exterior these are the signals that I have on the ship and I do have Sierra Mike which is a 5% speed boost so keep that in mind when we're talking about the maneuverability over here which is 31 knots um, flags we are flying the community contributor flag and I have the community contributor camouflage mounted. So, now then, for the commander. This is an 18 point commander. Um, for the tier 1 skills, I took two of them. Priority target and expert loader. For the tier 2 skills, I took three jack of all trades expert marksman and adrenaline rush for the tier 3 skills I took basics of survivability and superintendent and finally for the tier 4 I took fire prevention so that is the captain skills now for the ship stats as it sits right now concealment detectability by sea 13.3 kilometers by air, 9.2. Maneuverability, max speed, 31 knots. Turning circle radius, 800 meters. Rudder shift time, 11.5 seconds. AA defense is pretty weak with a score of 35. So when you get up tiered and those carriers come after you, um, yeah, it's not going to be good for you. Artillery. 4 times 2, 356 millimeters as the main armament. Um, maximum HE shell damage is 5,200. And maximum AP shell damage is 10,500. And it fires out to 16.7 kilometers. Survivability, 51,100 hit points. So, what do I think of this ship ah well I'll tell you what I think I think if you show someone your broadside you're going to get punished look how high the Citadel is above the water so yeah if you show this broadside you're you're gonna take some punishment but you know there's always a flip side to every coin and this may be the downside the upside is you can bow tank the shit out of some people 
let's look at the front of the citadel here that's 250 let's add on the other armor look at this the lower belt right here 125 millimeters and the upper belt 75 so this thing can really uh, bow tank I don't know if this will change or not but hey with this ability to buy bow tank the super firing turrets you can at least get four rounds heading toward the enemy uh, at each shot if you start pulling around to the side where you can get your uh, back turrets in on the fight mm, you run the risk of getting citadel but uh yeah if you show your broadside for sure you're gonna take that punishment so don't do that i do it all the time and i pay for it all the time it's just simply because i'm not paying attention or yeah you know lack of situational awareness or you know i get in a situation where i get flanked so yeah don't be like me anyway why don't we hop into a game and see what I was able to do with the tier 5 Russian BB, Peter the Great. Here we go. All right, New Dawn. Let's see how we compare. The New York looks pretty good. Konik, good. Congo, good. Orion, good. I love seeing green. Love see green on my ship instead of red. So this looks like we're going to do pretty well. So we are top tier in this game, which is nice. Here we go. All right. Get my site adjusted to where I want it warships if you're listening we'd like to be able to preset that at your favorite distance and then just have it stay there that would be good all right Got some enemy rocket aircraft approaching. Enemy bombers. Go ahead and select my sector there looks like we got a nice little line of screening ships that are going to be up in front of me that'll be pretty nice Hey, we shot down an aircraft. Look at there. It's a bonus. 395 damage. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. I'm turning, I'm turning, I'm turning. My brand new ship. You just scratched my paint all up. Okay, well, it'll be all right. What do we got in range? Nothing really. They're all just barely out of range. Phoenix? Is that a Phoenix? Let's see, I don't know how good these guns 
Gonna be at this distance. I thought he was turning in, so. And two more planes, look at there. 1,050, that could have been better. If he stays on this course, maybe it will be to watch these torpedo bombers. Maybe it'll be better. Now, come on. Oh, I must have missed him completely. All right. I just took a hit from the conic. Did not do much. More torpedo planes coming in. All right. Now, I'll take that trade. I'll take that trade. Just lost the destroyer. Okay, let's see if we can give him another salvo. I'm taking fire from the side, man. It's getting too hot. Got to go. Too many ships can see my side. about the knots are nothing I can do about it okay this is bad 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 spot Right, kind of bird. Oh man, that could have been better. Gain some health back. I am the only ship over here. This is. This is not, not looking good. Oh! That was good. All right. Run, Forrest, run! Phoenix. Got to watch for torps from this Izakazi over here. He just died, but may still be some torps in the water. Okay, those are friendly torps. All right, we got a citadel on the Phoenix. That's nice. Let's see if we can do it again. Pretty 
gain some health. Oh, 4,000. I'll take that. Start turning back in toward that Koenig. front turrets another plane Kuma out. There we go. There we go. Kuma's got torps in the water. And it looked like the dodge them all and I'm gonna eat this one. Oh all right my secondaries on this ship rear turrets there we go this Phoenix is still peppering me Two fires going. Come on. Let's get this. This look pretty good. Yes. All right. Torpedo bombers coming in from the left side. Try to put rear toward him and see if I can dodge these dwarfs. Oh no. No, this is going to be bad. Oh! Man, that was lucky. There's a dang carrier. down another plane. Is that 13 now? This thing might have better AA than I thought. All right. Try to get some shots in on this carrier before the Congo gets over there and kills it.
the Exeter over there. Hey. Oh, he's going for the ram. He's going for the ram. Put my secondaries on him. Oh, oh, and he missed. All right. Let's reload. Come on. Here we go. <laughs> it's a peddler. <laughs> oh, nice. Alright, what do we got left? Another carrier and two cruisers. But I don't know that I'm going to be able to chase any of them down, so we're just going to pull in to the cap here and see if we can cap this out. There's the Orion over there. He's in range. Maybe I can farm a little bit of damage and get up to 100k. Let's see. Didn't do much. And there's the other carrier. See if we can hit him. Ooh, a citadel. That look, that put me over 100k. 105. Nice. And I'm not going to be able to cap out as long. Is that Exeter and uh, Orion can continue to shoot me? Oh, I lost the Exeter. I was pulling around to try to give him some shot. Wait, there he is. And I missed him for the most part, anyway. Torpedo bombers coming in. Oh, I think I'm going to eat these. Yeah. And flooding. Go ahead and fix that. Shots in on the Orion there. It's another 5k. Gonna see if I can stop and back up and get out of gun sight of this Exeter. Stay in the cap here. All oh, those look pretty good. Uh, 2,000. Shot down another plane. Let's get a salvo off before he gets behind this hill. Come on. 6,000.
Here comes aircraft again. I'm not going to be able to cap this out if they hit me. Orion took a shot. Let's see if we can finish him off. Come on. Yes! All right. That would have been a Kraken. Looks like everybody else is well out of gun range now, so... We'll just sit here and see if we can cap this out. We're not going to have time. The game's about to end. There we go. There we go. Take a look. 398,000, 12,000 with 4,000 free XP, 131,000 damage, 5 ships destroyed, 5 citadels. That's not bad. First place in the team. Look at that, 30,000 in that one salvo. Woo! That'll do. I will take it. And some damage to the Clemson, so. Oh well. Okay. The Peter the Great Russian Tier 5 Battleship. Um, what do I think of it? Well, first of all, let's remember that it, this is still a work in progress. All stats and statistics can and probably will change. They usually um, give us the ships for a little while, go back and make some changes, give them back to us, let us test them again. So I really don't think this is going to be the final version of this ship but as it stands right now I like it I really like the strong bow armor do I think they're going to change it yes I think people are going to complain enough about it that they're going to change it for me doesn't bother me all that much it's kind of offset by the punishment that you can take if you show your broadside to somebody so yeah those two things kind of offset and if you find a Peter the Great that is bow tanking you and you can't do anything about it, well, hopefully that's what you have teammates for. You know, destroyers, aircraft carriers, send some torpedoes from the side, make them alter course. Hopefully you'll get some shots in. If it's a one-on-one -on -one situation, you might not be able to deal with it. But hey, sometimes you run into a better ship with a better player and you die. It happen It happens to me all the time. So I can't get too upset about it. But as it stands right now, I think it's pretty good. I like it, um, but I'm pretty sure it's going to change. If you've liked this look at the work in progress, Peter the Great, hit that like button. If you didn't, don't. Subscribe if you would. But as always, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. Nerd out.